Have you ever wondered how the volatile dance of politics can shift the social harmony in the seemingly tranquil Indian villages? In the bygone days, before the dawn of the 21st century, Indian villages were sanctuaries of peace and harmony. The village heads, unaffiliated with any political party, were universally accepted. The societal structure reflected the purity of the village's natural elements, the air, the water, and the earth. However, as the 21st century unfurled its wings, party politics began to infiltrate these serene hamlets, keeping pace with the rise of social media in India. Media platforms, including television, played a significant role in this political seepage. Villagers began to draw lines in the sand, dividing themselves along the lines of political parties. Village heads, now backed by one party or another, turned their focus to strengthening their party's foothold in the village. The aim was to align as many villagers as possible with their respective political parties, an objective that inevitably bred division. This shift had a ripple effect, influencing government works in the villages and giving rise to favoritism. The once strong social and personal connections started to crumble, becoming mere echoes of the past. Festivals and cultural events, once a collective celebration, lost their communal fervor. The village chowks and shops, once bustling with discussions on social issues, are now flooded with politically charged conversations, fueled by misleading information from social media. Assistance, which was once offered freely, regardless of the circumstances, is now contingent upon party affiliations. Political and ideological connections have certainly evolved, but at a cost. The social fabric and harmony, once the essence of these villages, are slowly fading away day by day. In the face of this evolution, one can't help but reflect on the current state of Indian villages. It's a stark reminder of the pressing need to restore social harmony, to rebuild the bridges that politics has burnt, and to rediscover the unity that once defined the spirit of these villages. The question remains, can we navigate the turbulent waters of politics and find our way back to the shore of social harmony? Only time will tell.